Hey guys, welcome to Eltham to Sunnymead Garden and this is day two of our garden restoration here right next door to our house next door uh, that we did about eight years ago well we're doing this one next door now and we're going to build amazing big vegetable beds three large vegetable beds that are going to go across facing east and west so the sun from the north comes down onto them three large big wide beds with a nice uh, bird bath in the center that's going to be the veggie beds it's all going to be natural we're going to use heaps of rock dust lucerne pea straw raised a little dug in a little bit absolutely beautiful what we're going to do here is this is one of the beautiful orange trees that's been a little bit neglected we're going to take some of our mandarin trees that we've got and some kumquats and we're going to build a citrus grove in here and look at this beautiful little old push lawnmower. We're going to make this a bit of a feature in the garden as well to uh, make sure we can remember how people used to cut their lawn and who knows if it can uh, work again we might use that to cut our grass and use that in our compost. Right, what else we're going to do? Come down here. This is going to be where our girls, have a look at the girls, we're going to have about 20 girls in a brand new enclosed chook run that's going to also be an orchard. So we're going to have a nice 12 metre by about 7 metre wide chook run with orchard inside with a nice big fence along it. And along that fence, getting all the beautiful sun coming down from the north, is going to be a grow wall. So we're going to grow lettuces, herbs and all different crops on a vertical grow wall to make maximum use of the space we have. And that's just the start for what we're doing here in Eltham. We're going to use rock dust, we're going to use straw, manure, compost, and it's going to be wonderful. And this is day two, and we're going to do it in about the next six to eight weeks. We're going to prepare the soil, plant out, and have lovely vegetables and chickens and eggs and fruit trees everywhere.